hey guys and welcome back to my channel so today i'm gonna change this quite horrible looking hairstyle into a very cute bun like this so it's going to be very simple i'm just using a tooth comb to undo the ends of my hair yeah so when i do this part i use my hands to undo the rest of the plait i just find it's a lot more comfortable for me when i do it like that I am then going to use a really really lovely afro hair comb which makes combing out my hair a lot faster. I tend to hold down the root because it just makes it a lot less painful when I'm combing my hair. As you can see this part is extremely painful because my hair is very thin at the moment and quite dry. If you watch my previous video you see that I had a lot of hair loss due to stress and probably due to a poor diet as well so this year my goal is just going to be looking at how I can improve my diet and get that hair growth back up so the middle part is the thickest part of this hairstyle that I did and I'm going to use Cantu which is a really lovely product it has shea butter and it just makes it a lot easier to comb through my hair because it makes my hair a lot softer and it's really moisturizing. Actually the amount of hair loss I have is not that bad compared to before when I used to comb my hair out. So yeah, I've been reading up online about how to grow my hair and also I've noticed that I'm getting quite a few grey hairs on my head. So all of those articles that I have read have linked this to stress and also poor circulation. So I'm going to try and massage my head a lot more after having a shower and also try mindfulness to reduce the amount of stress I have. In my life I mean stress is a precursor for a lot of things so reducing stress is always good and mindfulness is always good too so yeah I'm nearly done with undoing my hair thank God and yeah this is what it looks like combed out and yeah it's quite short if you watch my previous video you'll be able to see I had a huge afro before and it was quite thick so I'm going to use Cantu to make the whole of my hair really soft and I love this part because Cantu smells really nice. Anyway, going back to the grey hair topic, I don't really think it's that bad having grey hair but I don't really want my hair to be grey right now so that's why I'm trying to look for ways to prevent it. But I won't stress myself out about it that much because all of that can cause more hair loss. Anyway, I heard that grey hair is a sign of wisdom and I've had it since I was younger. So yeah, anyway, so I'm going to take this lovely silver ribbon and I'm going to tie it with the ends facing towards the back and glide it over my forehead slowly into the bun size that I want. Today I'm going to do a smaller bun because I find that's sometimes easier to manage. And I'm going to make sure I don't do it too tight because I don't want to get any more hair loss at the front of my hair as well. And then I'm going to do a little crossover tie because I, found doing a, I find doing a crossover tie makes it easier to manage. I try and make sure that it's not too tight at the back as well because I feel like I get headaches if I make it too tight. And that's it done my cute little bun hairstyle finished and I used Cantu as well to help hold in place and it makes it a lot less likely for it to get messy during the day and that's it my cute bun is completed um, if you enjoyed this video guys please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel thanks